Uh, all right, the pandemic has caused many a changes, but in sync dance studios found a way to keep a moving and a grooving. Dina is standing by to learn more about their virtual production. Yes, we're about to say hi, hi, hi to in sync in Auburn. Yeah, good morning to all of you over there in the Auburn area. This is Kristen and she joins us from the studio this morning, looking a little more quiet these days. Kristen, good morning to you. Tell us about what has been going on since COVID and this virtual uh, production you're putting together. Yeah, hi, Dina. Um, yeah, it's really quiet here. We haven't seen students here for several weeks now. Um, we've been back and forth since COVID on Zoom, um, in person with you know, smaller class sizes. Unfortunately, because of COVID, we've lost about 60% of our students. Um, and yeah, and our company dancers, we really wanted to give them something special to work towards because usually we have three performances a year and they haven't seen the stage in over a year. So we decided to make a virtual performance with our local partners at Inner Voice Media. And it's got so many fun things in it, including green screen, CGI, and it's just such a cool experience that the dancers get to experience. And if COVID didn't happen, um, in hindsight, that's, none of this would have ever happened. So it's a cool experience. What I, I mean, it really is such a silver lining to come out of this. I mean, what a great thing for these students to have to be a part of in, in the middle of such a difficult year. And so, yeah, tell me more about what you all do there, what kind of dance you feature. And of course, we'll get to the details on how people can watch the virtual performance. But I want to know more about your classes you offer. Yeah, so um, we've actually are in our 30th season here at NSYNC. Um, and we offer anywhere from ballet, tap, jazz, contemporary, hip hop, um, ages two to adults. Um, and yeah, now because of COVID too, we now have a virtual Zoom option ah. for those who can't come in or for classes that are too big. We actually do um, partial enrollment on Zoom and partial enrollment in studio at the same time. Wow. Um, so the teachers have had a fun time juggling things. Um, <laughs> But yeah, and in a normal year, we do three major performances. We do our annual Nutcracker performance. Um, we do a showcase and we do an annual ballet and we sell about 15 to 2000 tickets to each one of those events in one weekend. So wow. our community is desperately missing the performing arts. <laughs> yes. Oh, and so am I. I am missing being able to go out and meet all of you in person. Um, but Kristen, tell people Aww. how they can watch the virtual performance. It's next week and I, my friend, I'm going to be logging on because I can't wait to see how all this was put together with oh, the great. CGI. <laughs> Yeah, it is. It's been it's been such an amazing project. We had no idea it was going to be this big and inner voice has done such an amazing job. Um, so starting next Friday, it's going to be on demand for two weeks. So Friday, January 8th, starting at six o'clock p.m. till um, January 23rd. And you can log on to our website at InSyncDanceOfAuburn.com to purchase tickets um, and all the proceeds are going to help InSync Dance. Um, try and recover from the COVID-19 pandemic. We've got a really big 2021 plan and we just want to make sure that we continue to progress and give these kids every opportunity they can to perform. Absolutely. Well, Kristen, it's so great to meet you, even if it is virtually through the screen this morning. And for yeah. all of you parents <laughs> looking to get your kids into something in the new year, virtual dance classes, it's such a wonderful way to give them something energetic to kind of go do and be a part of something. So, Kristen, thank you. Out. We'll have information posted yeah. to our website, thank too. Thank you. Bye. Happy New Year. All right, Cody. Thank you very much.